going on everybody? So today I'm doing a little bit of a meal prep just for two days. I know it's not like a long time, but um, I have a lot of chicken left over from last week's deal that I still want to revamp and still eat. I don't want to waste it. Um, so what I'm going to do is, if you all have followed me on social media, you saw that I've, I grilled out some chicken not too long ago. So I have some of that still left over. And it can get me through two more days. Because there was a lot of chicken in there. A lot. It was a good deal. So what I'm doing right now is I am uh, heating up some seasoned mixed greens. And it comes with its own like season packet. Which I wasn't going to use at first. But then when I was like looking at the macros for four servings. So I'm going to do two servings. And it, I mean like per serving it's only 30 calories. Only half a gram of fat four uh, carbs, two proteins, so it's not really like anything in it. I'm also adding in some frozen mixed peppers, green peppers, red bell peppers, yellow bell peppers, and onions, and I'm going to do half of the bag today, half the bag tomorrow, and you know, the macros on that is 31, cal or, sorry, 31 calories, and five carbs, two protein, no fat, so it's awesome. Um, the reason why I'm doing the frozen ones is because um, I like that they cook, how they cook and everything, especially when I am meal prepping and I'm on the go and stuff like that and I'm kind of like in a rush about getting stuff done so I can just open it. Sorry guy, everything is ready to go. I do, however, have fresh peppers and tomatoes in the refrigerator, but those what I do is just like, I literally take them and have them as a snack. I usually will cut them up. If I don't have time though, I will like just eat them like an apple, so it's just like whatever you want to do. So I have I have my vegetables heating up in the pot right now, so they will um, freeze. And what I'm gonna do is put in the grilled chicken that I had left over, and that'll be 12 ounces per day. Is what I'll have. I'm gonna chop it up really nice. Um, I have some seasonings that I'm gonna put into it as well. I have some Italian seasoning. I'm gonna put some lemon juice, lime juice, some garlic powder, and Himalayan pink salt, which is amazing. And then I have this uh, Kingsford Original No Salt All Purpose Seasoning. It's like for grilling and everything. And I really like it. Um, I do have the Mrs. Dash Chipotle as well. I didn't want to use that right now because actually the chicken was in that as well. The chicken also has this in it too, but it's whatever. Um, so I'm going to put that um, in the pot and let it cook up real fast. They'll prep it out. And then I have some like other things I'm going to do too for quick snacks. I have some of these, which I love these things. They're the core power. Um, I have the four packs, so they're 24 uh, grams of protein. Which is amazing and I love them. Um, but they are 140 calories, 2 grams of fat. They have 6 carbs and like I said, 24 grams of protein. Something quick and easy on the go where you can just get it and go. The reason why I love these, um, especially more so than like the muscle milk, is because muscle milk tastes like a protein powder. And I, I just don't like it as much. I can do it. I, I will drink them if I need to. Um, I try not to. <laughs> uh, but I will if I need to. The reason why I love these, the chocolate tastes just like chocolate milk. The strawberry tastes just like strawberry milk. And they have a vanilla, which tastes like melted vanilla ice cream. So, when you have a sweet tooth, you don't want to actually like destroy your diet. And I have those. I have some other snacks as well. So another thing I have is these rice uh, puddings, and they are like cinnamon flavored, cinnamon vanilla flavored, and they're amazing. I love them. I mean, like the macros on it: 120 calories, two grams of fat, 22 carbs, four protein in it, which is amazing. And of course, like I have my stereotypical stuff that. I Oh my gosh, I just like I'm told on my rice puddings. No. But I have blueberries. And then I'm so much stuff in my fridge. 
fridge. And we have the peppers. Ooh, we have the good apples. And then I also have, I love the Wicos triple zero yogurts just because they taste amazing and they're like blowing everything so I can fit them in. I have my cherry tomatoes that are just like beets. Also have bits, which is a naughty and nice rice pudding and it's a mocha flavor, which is to die for. So when I'm like feeling extra, you know, it's okay. I'll eat that. Um, have celery in here because I, full disclosure, have um, a lot of bowel issues. Um, so I suffer from non-diagnosed um, IBS. There's certain foods that will set my stomach off and my bowels will go crazy and I'll blow it up and stuff like that. And it usually is like high fiber foods. So what I do is I take the apple cider vinegar pills and I eat a lot of celery because celery is really good for your digestive system as well. Um, I'm trying to see what else I have in here that I'm like smunching on. This is, this is my theme. This is my theme. Here's my baby dolls. There's so many baby dolls. When I say baby dolls, they're all my dogs. I have three. And oh yeah, I also have guacamole. You can never go wrong with guacamole. I mean, come on guys. If you don't like guacamole, which I say that my boyfriend does not like guacamole, but it's okay. He's coming to the, the good side, not the dark side. Because at least I got him now on eating sushi which is amazing because sushi is life and the fact that he just loves it I wouldn't say loves it but he'll eat it now which is great so I don't have to be like can we go here and like wonder if he'll actually eat anything he will because he likes it okay so let's get back to the cooking My chicken in the pot it's all shredded up now and it's cooking in there with my vegetables have not added any seasonings yet but I'm just about to so let's do it. what I forgot to tell you all is that I'm gonna put in there the wishbone light Italian dressing uh, macros are 35 calories 2.5 grams of fat and they have three carbs zero protein in it so there's 15 servings in this I'm going to use a decent amount, probably about six servings, so three servings per day, um, to give it some good flavor. And then, first I'm going to add in this like little seasoning packet from the veg. Mix that up in there. And it's really not a lot, so I'm not really worried about the sodium that was in that because it is really salty. Um, but there's so much in this pot that it literally looks like I didn't even put anything in it. So now, I'm gonna put in some of my lime juice. Actually, I don't need to open up this one. I have one open. And gonna put in some lemon juice as well. And I love seasonings just because they're like no calories or anything. So you don't really have to worry too much about it. Of course, like this I do, um, but there's not really bad. Some um, Italian seasoning here. A little bit of Himalayan. Himalayan. Himalayan pink salt. garlic powder and I just like garlic powder because um, I just love the taste of garlic so you know all right now some of the Italian so there's 15 servings so let's do it So 
what I love about this, of course it has a lot of protein in it, but it has a lot of like veggies in it, so it's going to have a lot of those filler foods, so it's going to make me stay full, some good macronutrients in there, good vitamins, minerals, so I'm really excited about this because I'm really trying to eat as clean as possible, know what's going into my body, and really just feel it, so like each day I have a good workout, and I know my body's powered the way it should be, and I want to make sure that whatever I'm putting into it isn't going to be like detrimental to what my goals are in my fitness journey or in life in general because I want to make sure that I'm healthy um, as well throughout this whole process of just becoming a better version of myself. And yes, of course, I do have my cheat days where I, you know, eat whatever I want to um, and just really just let my body have like a day to like recoup and like be like, oh, there's, you know, those bad foods I guess I was craving. But, um, this is what I'm going to be eating for the next two days for like my big, big meals. And I may just pump it out into like two uh, containers, but I just nibble on it whenever I can. Alright guys, so I have gotten done, um, today just worked on some like social media stuff to kind of like get some more content out there and got my workout in, did some cardio as well, went to the grocery store and got a few items so I could cook and everything, so that's what I did today and I'm just, you know, eating a little snack right now, some um, triple zero oikos Greek yogurt with some, I put some like blueberries, fresh blueberries in it just to give it some extra, you know, texture and some more than just like plain yogurt. Um, but I just want to say that I hope that everyone will stay tuned to my channel and really just like want to see where I go and like what my content will be because, you know, I really just want to make sure that everyone feels like they have someone out there that, you know, has been where they've been and can build up and see how they did it and everything. So here's to my journey and here's to me just, you know, making the most out of every day and knowing what your self-worth is and not just like looking at, oh, that's my end goal and just seeing how I'm going to get there and try to get there too fast and it not happening and get disappointed. No, I know that like the goals I have set in my head, like for myself, like both mentally, physically, and just like, you know, goals that I want to achieve within like my career and what I want to do in life. I know it just won't happen overnight. It'll take a long time. And when I say that, you know, I feel like working out and getting healthy and building muscle and really getting the like body that you want, that you feel amazing in, that you feel confident in, I feel like that's a great way to look at life because, you know, if everything was easy, it would be easy to have the perfect body. It would be easy to build muscle or get really lean or whatever your goals are for yourself. It would be it's so simple. Everyone would be that way, but it's not. You have to work for it. You have to earn it. You have to put in the time, the effort, the want, the drive. You have to make sure that, you know, you're not out there just partying or drinking or, you know, wasting your time doing stuff where you could be working on who you are, working on bettering yourself, reaching those goals instead of doing things that will, like, make you go backwards and everything. And that's what I want to show on my channel is not just, like, just the fitness part because that's going to be, like, that's the main point of my channel is for your fitness and how to be healthy and fit that into your lifestyle and not just make it to where it's just like, I want to be healthy and all these people make it seem so easy. And I'm going to be there saying, you know, I'm there with you. I, I, I'm going to help you as much as I can. And I want to, I want to build you up. I want you to know that you can do it because you can, you have the strength to do it. And I believe in you. So I just want you to know that at, at least you have me on your side and I want you to know that, that I hope that means a lot to you um because i'm out there with you i'm you know doing what i need to do to keep healthy and keep going and i'm not making excuses of why i can't get to the gym or anything like if i have a busy day or if i'm tired or something like that like if i have to miss a day of the gym 
then I'm going to make up for it. It's not that. I'll, like, I will definitely make up for it. But you don't make excuses of why you can't. If you can't go for an hour, if you can't go for longer than an hour, if you can't go for 30 minutes, do what you can do. Fit it into your schedule. That's the thing is don't look at everyone else's life and how they do their life. You have to look at, this is what I do. How can I fit it in? And everything. So that's what we're doing. I'm just like chilling here for a little bit. About to get ready for work. Going to be there all night. And then get up early in the morning, in the morning and do it all again, which is, you know, that's just what you have to do, you know, to reach those goals and reach those dreams. So, everybody, stay tuned. Don't forget, hit that like button, comment, subscribe, and when you subscribe to my channel, don't forget to hit the notification button, the little bell, so you can get the notifications of when I upload new videos, new content, and just stay tuned. Love you guys.